I'm afraid to click on it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing something that I typically don't do and that's kind of like a reaction video. I'm going to be reacting to my first video ever on YouTube. So as of today, it's been a year since I started YouTube, posted my first video and have been posting ever since. And so I thought it'd be kind of fun to go back and look at the very first video that I ever did. I don't really remember what I said or how it went down because since the moment I posted it, I have not looked at it again. Just because I've always been so like uncomfortable with re-watching some of my videos, especially my first one ever. So, I'm going to bring you guys along. If you haven't seen my first video ever on YouTube, I'll link that down below for you guys to check it out. You guys should check it out if you want to see baby me a year ago. This video, fun fact, if you guys didn't know, I filmed it seven times before I posted the video that went up. And the reason being was because I was so new to like talking to a camera and like obviously I'm still learning and I'm still getting comfortable as the days go by but the very first video that I ever did I was so uncomfortable. I would not look at the camera. I was self-conscious about a lot of things as far as like appearance and just like how to communicate things and my background and lighting and so like all this stuff I was like super self-conscious about and I was just super scared to like post my first video ever but anyway so like I said this video went up a year ago and I'm gonna react to it so I'm gonna go ahead and watch it with you guys and we'll go from there excuse my bulky headphones they're the only ones I have so here we go I'm so scared. I'm already looking at this photo and so the thumbnail um, is a screenshot of like a portion of my video and it looks very blurry but whatever. <gasps> oh god. Oh god I can't do it. I already feel so uncomfortable. <laughs> ah, the very first thing I said was I don't know what to do because I'm really uncomfortable if that's not the truth. Wow, my teeth were so white. <gasps> what the heck? <sighs> I need my teeth to look that white again. Shoot, they look so good. Uh, you know what the funny thing is? I'm gonna take this off because I can't really hear myself talk. One of the biggest insecurities I had with posting this video and the reason I filmed it so many times apart from like all the other stuff was my teeth. I was super self-conscious about my teeth and honestly that's still one of the things that I'm not super comfortable with is just because they're not like super straight. But wow, they look so good. Anyway, shoot. So this video is a Q&A. It's the first video that I did. My hair was recently growing out in this video so i had decided to go like really short like above the shoulder haircut and i loved it so much that i wanted to keep it like that for a while and so i decided to go back to the salon not even that long after i got it cut to get it cut again so that it would stay short and the lady who cut it a second time did a terrible job terrible terrible job because it was so uneven it was so choppy that I had to go and get it fixed again by the manager and then that's why my hair looks so short here but I did like short hair days you know the lighting doesn't look that bad for my first video I feel like Again, I filmed this video seven times, so this backdrop looks so bland, but I think it looks super cute. It's my old bedroom back in Orlando, and I have a cute little record player and salt lamp and plants and stuff. And honestly, I think it looks super cute. I don't know why I was so hard on myself. I did, I decorated my backdrop seven times, and I went to various different rooms in my parents' house to film this video, and it turned out so cute. Man. Gotta not be so hard on yourself, guys. Oh, God. Mm. <laughs> I want my teeth to look this white again. I can't even. Oh, well, I think I'm doing good. Oh, this is us. <gasps> that is my favorite TV show. I am finally caught up. A year ago when this video went live, I had recently discovered that that TV show existed. And so I didn't want any spoilers, but now I'm all caught up. Uh, wow, this video is actually pretty short. 5 minutes and 21 seconds. Man, I remember when I first started my YouTube channel, the very first videos that I was posting, it was so hard for me to even make it to 5 minutes. 
bullet journaling oh I don't do bullet journaling anymore yeah same that's still true I got into bullet journaling that's one of the hobbies I liked a year ago and I still think it's such a cool concept but I got so caught up on making every single page look super cute that I didn't even bother to like use the practicality of the journal if that makes sense ah <sighs> biggest pet peeve what is it oh it still is god I hate that I do not like when people scrape their fork on their teeth all right, I'm going to fast forward a little bit because I'm starting to kind of remember what these questions were about. Guys, because I filmed this video seven times, I actually basically already had memorized like my answers to every single question, which is why surprisingly when I was editing this video, it was a lot easier than a lot of my other videos because I didn't have to like pause every time I messed up because I had every answer and every question already rehearsed in my head because I filmed it seven times too many times and honestly I wish that I still had some of the footage of like the other videos that never went up but unfortunately I don't because at that time I only had one SD card with very limited storage so I had to delete everything as I was filming wow oh France that was beautiful <laughs> guys it took me the entire day to film this video like in my outro, you can see the lighting shift so much because for one, I don't know how to control lighting. But also, it was already so late in the night because it took me so long to finish this video. Wow. Oh, I was only posting a video once a week. <gasps> wow. That was so cute. I'm so proud. That's insane. I actually posted this on my sister's birthday, which was also International Women's Day. And I did not mean to have that happen or like coincide with that event. It just happened to fall on that day because I finally filmed this video and I was like, you know what, screw it. Like I got to post something or nothing's ever going to go up. And wow. Oh, that's insane. Oh, that was so cute. You guys should check it out. I was kind of concerned that it was going to be like super cringe because a while back when I was going through some of my videos, like halfway through the year when this video went live, I like clicked on it really quickly and I was like, oh shoot, this is so cringe. And then I like went back and didn't watch it. So I haven't watched it since, but it's actually so cute. And honestly, I hope that you guys <laughs> enjoyed watching me react to that. It was probably not as big of a reaction as I anticipated. I'm very proud of the fact that like I finally got a video out there and it's been a year and I wonder how many videos I have up since. How can you look at that? I have a total of 84 videos out there. I think I did the math right. It may be 74, it may be 84, but regardless, I think I have come a long way. Obviously I have a lot to learn and I'm so thankful for all of you guys who have joined my channel, who have subscribed, who have commented, who have liked, who have watched. It means a lot and I've loved getting the opportunity to bring you guys along on my journey and getting you guys introduced into everything that I like to do and my family members and my husband and my faith and all that great stuff. And honestly, I'm super, super thankful. And yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed that. And if someone is watching this video and you are out there and you want to start a YouTube channel or you want to start some type of something but you're too afraid because of your insecurities or lack of knowledge or skill you should just go for it I did and honestly it's one of those things where I still have so much to learn I'm very aware of that and at times it's super discouraging to like see certain numbers drop or to like have certain things not do as well as you thought they would but I'm honestly very happy. I think that I came out a lot more motivated having watched my first video ever than having come out cringed, if that makes sense. So I love you guys. Thanks again for all of your support. I hope that you enjoyed this. And again, if you guys are wanting to do something like this, just go for it. Don't think about the insecurities or about anything along those lines because it'll all work out. You'll get better. And at the end of the day, like certain things that like bug you or you don't think are perfect are honestly not as a huge of a deal as they may seem so yeah all right well i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys next time bye